A high-ranking official has said that the Gattac autonomous stealth unmanned combat air vehicle being developed by the Aeronautical Development Establishment will have an all-up weight of 12.5 to 13 tons, which means that its weight range aligns closely with the all-up weight of the Tejas Mark 1A fighter jets. Godrej Aerospace will start delivery of eight units of 48 kN dry cavalry engine by end of 2023 that will be used for testing and completing flight certification, so that a full-scale prototype is ready for rollout by 2025. The DRDO will seek financial clearance from the Ministry of Defense for the development of the 13-ton new CAF, after all flight tests of the SWIFT technology demonstrator is completed, and the first prototype rollout is expected by 2026. India's plans to integrate the cavalry engine with the Tejas aircraft is still on, and as per the latest information, limited flight trials are expected to be conducted in the coming years. The DRDO is in advanced stages of developing an afterburner section, that will be integrated with dry cavalry engine to deliver a peak power of 74 kN thrust. While the prospect of replacing the 84 kN F404 engines with a lower 74 kN cavalry engine is unlikely, but the gas turbine research establishment is determined to further enhance the cavalry engine core to generate 90 kN thrust engine. Bharat Electronics Limited and Israel Aerospace Industries have signed a Memorandum of Understanding to collaborate on addressing India's requirements in the domain of short-range air defense systems. The MOU aligns with the Make in India initiatives, and aims to leverage the collective capabilities of both firms in the domain of short-range air defense systems, fostering indigenous production and technological advancement. A new Delhi-based startup Veda Defense System has won a $36 million order to deliver 200 Veda X long-range swarm drones to the Indian Air Force. It has a range of about 150 kilometers that can be launched in small batches that will come together to attack or defend targets. The order for 200 swarm drones is the largest by value to a local startup by the Indian Air Force that will be delivered in the next 12 months. The Indian Navy is procuring counter drone systems worth 490 crore rupees that will be deployed on aircraft carriers and eight warships, which will help address the unique challenges posed by drones from a distance of above 5 kilometers. Apart from ships, these systems will also be operated on naval bases, as well as a mobile variant with 360 degrees coverage integral radar system. Several pictures have emerged of the Chinese Navy's new Type 54B stealth frigate, which shows that China has copied the French Aquitaine-class frigate design. The Type 54B features 100mm gun, a new double-sided rotating Acer radar on the main mast, and reports mention that it features 32-cell vertical launch system, but there is a speculation that there is a second VLS in that position. Just after five years of being commissioned, Myanmar has grounded all 11 JF-17 fighter jets due to technical issues, and has expressed dissatisfaction to Pakistan, as Pakistani engineers have failed to rectify the problems. Nigeria has also experienced a series of crashes and technical issues with the JF-17, after which Argentina has also declined to purchase the JF-17 Thunder from China and Pakistan. Thank <laughs> you.